again, everybody. I'm Christine Weesey, Baker Christine. Welcome back to my kitchen. Today we're going to be making cookies made with Oreo cookie spread. I found this in the peanut butter section of the grocery store. I was looking for some Biscoff cookie spread and I saw this, so I thought, why not make cookies with this? Everybody loves Oreos and I think it'll be great. I don't have any assistance with me today, but I have two dogs, our dog Charlie, and we're watching our neighbor's dog, Amber, so they may make a guest appearance or two today. Let's go over the ingredients. You'll need one cup of shortening. One cup of Oreo cookie spread. One cup of sugar. One cup of brown sugar firmly packed into your measuring cup. Two eggs. One teaspoon of baking powder. One and one half teaspoons of baking soda. One half teaspoon of salt. And two and one half cups of flour scooped from your flour bag or your flour container into your measuring cup so that you get the correct amount. Preheat your oven to 375 degrees. This pretty much starts out like any other cookie recipe. You're going to put your shortening in first. And the thing that I do to make the shortening come out easier is I spray the cup with Pam and then you don't get a big mess. So you might want to try that if you want the shortening to come out a little easier. Then you're going to add the cookie spread. I often wonder who comes up with the ideas for this stuff. This is awesome. Crushed up Oreos and butter and sugar. Are you kidding me? And then you add your brown sugar and your sugar and then grab your mixer and you're going to blend this all together. Probably take a couple minutes because this is a little bit thick. And then we add our eggs. And blend those in. Then we're going to slowly put in our dry ingredients and blend it all together, probably a low speed so it doesn't go flying all over the place. Then line your cookie sheets with a non-stick baking liner. Then grab your cookie scoop or your ice cream scoop and scoop out your dough. Pull it into a nice little ball. I flour my hands so the dough doesn't stick too much. And then you're going to stagger these probably about eight on a cookie sheet in case they spread a little bit. And you'll bake these at 375 from anywhere between nine and 14 minutes. And here's Charlie enjoying a little snooze on his Bill's blanket. And right after you take the cookies out of the oven, you can sprinkle them with a little powdered sugar to add a little extra sweetness. Thanks so much again for joining me today for the Oreo spread cookies. These are super easy. I think you'll really like them. And who doesn't love Oreos, right? A reminder, the recipe is coming up at the end of this video. It's in the YouTube description box, and it's also on my blog, bakerchristinelisi.wordpress.com. Remember to keep those recipe requests coming to me. I'm always looking for something new to bake. I look forward to seeing you again soon.